A system of shared responsibility is needed where funding comes from both domestic and international sources. With great concern, we are witnessing a funding backlash from donors. In September, Denmark announced a proposed HIV funding cut for the fast track period. And last week, we learned that Germany will not host the Global Fund Replenishment meeting. These de developments are especially disheartening and directly undermine national commitments to our global, co global collective targets. Fast track funding is imperative in meeting our fast track targets and ensuring that no one is left behind. We call on donors to live up to the promises made to help meet the sustainable development goals and reverse the cuts to HIV AIDS. The high level meeting on HIV and AIDS, on gas and drugs, and the global fund replenishment process are crucial opportunities to secure political and financial commitment to achieve these targets. More immediately, we recognize the catalytic role that UNAIDS is well positioned to play in this upcoming 2015 World AIDS Day. With our 2020 targets a mere four years away, UNAIDS has a critical and integral role in mobilizing political will across the SDGs to shed the business as usual, as usual approach and to confirm that the necessary resources are rallied. We look forward to working in close collaboration with UNAIDS to make this December 1st a game changer in our collective movement to end AIDS.